The following video is approximately five minutes long and includes audio description for people who are blind or have low vision. Title card. This presentation was prepared under federal financial assistance provided by FEMA's Grant Programs Directorate, U.S. Department of Homeland Security. Points of view or opinions expressed in this video are those of the authors and do not necessarily represent the official position of policies of FEMA's Grant Programs Directorate of the U.S. Department of Homeland Security. Title card. Cal OES Logo. Governor's Office of Emergency Services. Host in Wheelchair. Hi, I'm Richard DeVelder, Chief of the Office of Access and Functional Needs at the California Governor's Office of Emergency Services. I'm speaking to you today from the California Center. State Operations Center. The typical response during an earthquake, drop tables. cover and hold on, may not be the right choice for those of us who have disabilities or are older adults with other functional needs. Office during earthquake. Earthquakes strike suddenly, without warning, and they can occur at any time of the year, day or night. Map of US Nearly every zones. state and territory in the United States Seismograph. is at moderate to very high risk of earthquakes. Post and office. In the event of a major earthquake, the damage they can inflict could include power outages down power lines. and down power lines, Building on fire. gas leaks, fires, Building rubble. broken windows, and falling objects, which are dangerous for everyone man in and can be a greater threat to people with disabilities and older adults. Elderly man on news. We must plan Ambulance. for our response as if no one is coming to rescue us, Police car. because they are not. It is unrealistic to believe that there are enough resources for everyone to receive assistance. Post and office. Those of us who have disabilities or are older adults need to adapt earthquake preparation and response as the decisions we make could save our lives. The following simulation is for individuals with mobility needs. Man in wheelchair refrigerator. Earthquake start. He moves before boxes fall from the refrigerator. His wheelchair tips over. Oh, man, I need my phone. He drags himself to door. Help! Someone, please help me. Oh, what's my neighbor's name? Need to call him. Post with man in kitchen. What message would you like to give to others who have mobility disabilities? Well, I'm pretty independent, but this whole experience has taught me that I may need to be a little bit better prepared and get to know my neighbors better. Yes, it's very important for your neighbors and those around you most of the time uh, know how to assist you in an emergency. Absolutely. Post in office. We have just seen an example of how a person with a disability or older adult should respond during an earthquake. Have you thought about this scenario? and made preparations for what you would do, let's always remember that we are not helpless and we can take control of our plan and our response. Ambulance. Act as if no one is coming to rescue you. You are in charge. A simple buddy system is not lady enough. Man in wheelchair we need to build a support team, which include neighbors, man helping coworkers, senior lady off floor. friends, and family. Have practice Post sessions with them to ensure that they can help you Know what you need and be able to quickly provide instructions to others on how to assist you. Plan for all disasters. Think about what needs you would have after a disaster. Man himself on floor. Would you need to evacuate or shelter in place? He's texting on phone. What if technology fails? What if the power goes out and you no longer have cell phone, service? No service. Then Two what? Girls under table. If you have a family member with specific signing. emergency preparedness needs, think about all the different scenarios that could affect them. Be realistic. Firemen in smoky office. The government does not have enough resources and responders to help Children everyone. Wheelchair loading in van. If you need to evacuate, how can you leave the area? Man in wheelchair what if you cannot independently get downstairs? Do you have family, neighbors, or friends to assist you? Practice with earthquake drills. To know it is to do it. Being ready to evacuate or shelter in place is the key to staying safe in an emergency. Emergency items. In your plan, don't forget to build an emergency kit with essential items you need to keep with Backpack you. Being put in this includes medications, any consumable medical supplies, a whistle, Whistle's. and something very important, drive. a USB drive that includes important documents like your most recent medications, license. copy of your driver's license or ID, emergency contacts. In office. I really hope you take this to heart. This is about you saving your own life. Cal OES logo and web address, www.caloes.ca.gov. End of video.